Wisdom needed by commandment keepers. June 18. When the practices of the people do not come in conflict with the word of God or the law of God, we may confirm to them. If we as workers fail to do this, then we will not hinder uh, uh, the work of God or we will not only rather hinder our own work, uh, but we will place stumbling blocks in the way of those for whom we are laboring for. Uh, we will not only hinder their progress, but we will cause them to stumble and fall. The Bible tells us in the book of Matthew chapter 10 and verse 16, Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Let us consider for a moment the word sin. The word sin simply means uh, to order one to go to a place appointed. Uh, so what this tells me is that uh, witnessing in the uh, books of Jesus is not an option that we have. In other words, what this tells me is that we don't have the option uh, to witness for Christ, but uh, instead it is a command that he has given us uh, to go and witness for him. He has decided to send us out. And in sending us out, he gives us an advice, uh, just be wise as serpents and harmless uh, like dove. Uh, but you might wonder uh, today, how can I become an effective witness uh, for Christ Jesus? It is simple. How can we become an effective witness for Christ? Simply by representing Him in everything that we do. In other words, the way we dress, uh, we represent Him. Why? Because we are witnessing for Him. Uh, the way we speak, we should represent Him. Why? Because we are witnessing for Him. Uh, the way we have our attitude uh, towards each other, the way we love each other, the way we deal with each other, uh, we should understand that we are witnessing for Him. And in all things that we do, we should always represent Him. Why not trust in God's Word uh, today? Let us simply ask God for a desire to be more like Him every day. Every day with Jesus, we become more and more like Him. For that is the power of His Word. Why not let us pray? Father, we are so grateful that we can spend time with you every day. We just want to ask you uh, to help us to become more like you every day. We thank you and we want to ask you to help us to represent you in everything that we would do. Thank you so much. In Jesus' name, amen. Uh, remember, my dear friends, the power of the word every day will keep the enemy at bay. Get ready, get ready for your miracle.